All right, so sum six seven. I, I think of this problem almost like a, like a calculator in a sense. So like um, the calculator is either on or off. When we find a six, we're going to turn the calculator off, and we won't turn it back on until we find a seven. Um, and so when the calculator is off, we're not adding numbers to it. I'm going to track that using a boolean variable. You think of calling it like on off, or I'm going to name my boolean variable should add. I'm going to start it at true. So originally, I should add numbers that I find to the sum. Okay, uh, I'll loop to every number in the array. So just same same loop we've been writing so far. I, th I think the next one is the first one where we're actually going to change the, the loop. And uh, all right, so if that Boolean is true, then I should add the number. So sum plus equals nums bracket I. Okay. And later I'll return it. But why would I not add the number? Well, okay, the reason is if I find a six. So what I'm gonna do is before that, I'm gonna ask like, was that number a six? And if it was, then I shouldn't add the number so I'm going to set the variable that I had to false. And then what's going to happen is, is that's going to actually prevent me from adding that number. And it's going to stay there at false on all of the successive loop passes, unless, right, we find a seven. So afterwards, I'm going to ask, you know, you know, did we find a seven? Now, the timing here is kind of important because if you look at their examples, one of the things to note is that the sixes and the sevens both did not become part of the sum. So we don't really want to turn this thing back on until after the fact, if we did happen to find a seven. Okay. Oh, oops. I don't know what I was doing there. I wanted to say should add is true. All right. So that's going to prevent me from adding the six because I asked first. It's also going to prevent me from adding the seven because I don't turn it back on until after I'm past the seven onto the next number. Okay. I'm sure you may have solved this problem way differently than I did. This is just an idea. 